What is going on with Luard? Before watching this video, check out this beautiful playmat. Oh my god, you should go get it using the code SOLEM. Link will be in the description. So, I'm gone for like one week, maybe a week and a half. I was doing business stuff, I did not have time to make Vanguard content. And in that time, y'all managed to ruin everything. <laughs> what kind of clown fiesta did I have to witness? Now, if you didn't witness it, whoa, oh, whoa, you're so lucky. But if you had to witness it, dear God. Okay, so the moment Luard gets revealed, most people already knew all the skills. Because apparently, a bunch of leaked screenshots were going around and, and people weren't mad and essentially somehow people knew. So, okay, Luard got leaked and then it was confirmed, whoa! Suddenly, you had one park of people that said this is the most broken, insane thing ever. And other people saying, oh, it's not all that good. And that started an all out war online. I, I don't know why, I don't know how, but it happened. Within a few hours, suddenly all the shadow stuff was bought out. It was already going up, it was already being bought, but like, stuff was gone. In the span of a couple days, I'm not sure if it was before or after, we see this Phantom Blaster Superior Ride, which of course is gonna be insane. Like, like standards all about going first, the advantage you get from that, and then suddenly you now can go first, even if you go second. <laughs> and if you go first, you now go extra first. So of course it's gonna be good. And then people say, oh, this is broken. And then Luard gets revealed, and Luard is broken. Oh, is it broken? I don't really know. Why are people forgetting my boy Claret? My, my beautiful boy Claret. I didn't win this, by the way, I bought it. The other ones I did win. But. Luard's gonna be, what, a $700, $800 deck? Wow, wow, budget. Standard deck worth $800. I love my budget decks. Once that's all settled, you know, whew, people are starting to share their deck lists. And of course, everyone's saying all other people's lists are trash. So we have another war. More people freaking out. Oh, your Luard list sucks. Oh, your Luard list sucks. Oh, Luard's broken. Oh, Then suddenly they go, wait. We can play the Superior Ride engine inside Luard. We can play one Phantom Blaster Dragon, one Blaster Dark, and one of the Superior Ride thing, and the main can fetch them. And so that way we can Superior Ride in Luard. And then you had a new war. More people said, oh, that's broken. And other people said, oh, it's not even good enough to run. Then you had those two camps fighting as well. <laughs> so then we have those wars, even more wars around Lu This is literally, this is a moment for history. This is Vanguard history right here. I'm gone, and, and while I'm gone, shit just hits the fan. None well, of that's up to me, it's just coincidence. But this is Vanguard history, you know. You had like the, the Russian revolutions leading up to stuff, and then we had the Luard revolutions. Same shit. So once the war of, oh, superior ride, Luard, it's bad, no, it's great, oh, it's broken, uh, then suddenly you had the new wave. The wave where they went, wait, superior ride shouldn't even be in Luard. And so then suddenly people started bringing up, we should choice restrict this. We need to choice restrict the superior ride and Luard so that it's Phantom Blaster Dragon's thing and you can't play it in Luard. So apparently at first people thought it wasn't broken and others thought it was broken and now suddenly we need to choice restrict it despite it not being broken before. Okay. And then people went one step further. Oh no, 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 wait. This is not superior ride, guys. It's the main. We need to ban the main. <laughs> Because in the main is Shadow Paladin. If you right now play Shadow Paladin without in the main, what are you doing? The main does everything. The main gets you the plusing of Swordbreaker or soon Abyssal Owl, which is like a strict upgrade. Goodbye, my delete rares. Now it's gonna fetch you your right target. It already fetched you Fallen Dive Eagle. It fetched you Dead Armor Dragon. Now it's doing you the superior ride, the correct right targets. The main is everything. The main is insane. The main is the best card. It's the only card Shadow Paladin has. So now people are going, it's so broken, we need to fucking hit it. Okay, okay. And that's where we're at right now. So in the span of a week and a half or something, we've had six revolutions all around Luard. And all the prices are insane. I don't know what, the main's what, 40 now? 50 for a triple rare? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Also, Karen was bought out because apparently that with Luard. Oh, now Karen suddenly has a use, so now it's also what, 20? Swordbreaker was bought out, and then we saw Abyssal Owl, so goodbye. Uh, Branlin was already bought out, now it's extra bought out. <laughs> 
So if you want to play Shadows, it's too bad. It's over. Can't. It's gonna be an $800 deck. Yeah, we also saw the main SPs. So in the SP pack of Phantom Blaster Dragon, you can also get SP in the mains. Gee. Max Rarity Luard is gonna be impossible. Because you have two SP packs with cards you want. You gotta put them together. And you need to get your SP Branwins, maybe SP Morion Spear if you have room for that. Even base rarity, this deck is gonna be so expensive. Like, the whole facade of, oh, V made the game cheaper, you guys. That's already over. That's been done. Like, any rational person knew this was done. And now, the most expensive V deck is dwarfing the most expensive V deck. So it's done. Argument's over. V is more expensive than G. Cool. At least, if anything, all these revolutions <laughs> have at least destroyed that argument that debate is done. Now, the only debate we still have is how good is Luard actually? Because <laughs> I don't know. I haven't tested. I haven't paid attention to anything. I've just been doing business. Sorry. God, I, I wish... I wish I had paid attention because this, oh, beautiful, this, this, oh. If you're into shit posting or, or you like a little cynicism from time to time, this was peak. It was a lot on Vanguardians, quite some on Discord, quite some on Twitter. And I, I just wanted to share it with you. I needed to document the fact that this happened, all of this shitstorm. I just needed to have a video so we can never ever forget. So we can savor the taste. That is all. Like this video, subscribe, and I will see you soon. Ciao.